Ah, oh, wow. She can't stop shaking. <laughs> hey guys, welcome. So today we're checking out episode number nine of Jobless Reincarnation and this one is called A Chance Encounter. So last week was pretty intense. Rudy reaches his 10th birthday and Iris and her family plan a surprise party for him. Meanwhile, the strange orb hovering over the city remains a mystery as powerful entities across the world begin to take note of it. So obviously we've got some dodgy aspects of the show, of course, as, as part of the DNA of this anime. And then we've got this amazing world building with the, the magical entities, the orbs, all these warriors detecting the mana coming to the town to kind of take down and kill any strange characters and a dude turned up and tried to kill Rudy and there was a battle and it was cool but yeah the, the story really feels like it's kind of kicked off at that point the turning point funnily enough so uh yeah I'm, I'm really down to see where it goes next a chance encounter so without further ado let's go hey guys so check out my patreon link down below with all my socials so come say hi don't forget like and subscribe Ooh. Huh? Oh, wait. Is this the time before he was reborn? I'm a god? The man god? What? So this is his old form? Okay. What happened? Why is he here? Is this a dream? The wicked dragon god? Man god, dragon god. Just the tip? Dude, wow. It's just the tip. <laughs> As things are, you will die. The demon continent. No food, a lot of monsters. Okay, what's going on? What is this? Oh! A mana cataclysm. Transported somewhere. What? There'll be a man nearby. Rely on him. Okay, interesting way to open the episode. So he was mana cataclysm, he was unconscious, come to some kind of dreamscape. His old body talking to the man god. When you wake up, there'll be a man nearby. So it's just a, a weird dream. He tapped into something. Because I dare say that was a real conversation. Where's Ghislaine? She's out patrolling. There's a man nearby. That's not Ghislaine. It's a man. And he's nearby. Oh, he's... Just trying the different languages. Did God send you? Because he learns three languages, right? He's been studying. You two fell from the sky? So they're in a monster realm right now? You're a strange, strange child. Yeah, that's, that's, that's a given, that's for sure. The demon continent. Like another planet? Same planet? What? Right. Same planet. Different continent. A mana cataclysm has sent them halfway around the world. Well, this is a turn of events. Oh, Eris. <laughs> Good morning. Wow. Yeah, where is Ghislaine? She's somewhere else. She freaking out. <laughs> He's used to it. Oh, wow. She can't stop shaking. <laughs> Roy Jett, I gotta get the pronunciation. Help me down below, guys. Come on. 
I can't hear them saying the word. Like I try to listen for the pronunciation. They got a bad reputation, but they're all good guys. Well, not all. I'm sure there might be some assholes, but they seem. This guy seems decent. You're not gonna eat them. God. There's demons, though. There's monsters that will kill you. That's not exciting. I'm being a realist. I'd be terrified. So if they're on a different continent, do they have to travel over like a body of water or something, like an ocean, to get to the, the main, the central continent? I mean, how how far? Is this like the rest of the series traveling? We've got to get a monster attack soon too, right? I mean... Oh, that, is that a... that's a giant turtle. Oh, okay. You can't see the monsters unless you got a third eye. Your, your, your big brother. No, he's my boyfriend. <laughs> also, my cousin. Oh, a village. They got. The houses are made out of sh uh, tortoise shells. Was he going to get the chief? What? Oh. Right, this is the demon god language. Right. Right. Roxy? Wait, what, what? Roxy. Is alive? Oh, oh. Wait. He's, what is she? He's... Roxy's hometown. This is her family. Roxy is my daughter's name. He didn't look old enough to have a daughter. Oh, what? One Roxy, two Roxy's? Three Roxy's, four? That's a song. She left 20 years ago. What? How? She's like... She's like 15, 16? Oh, wow. She's 44. She's getting harassed by a little pervert. Little perverts everywhere in this show. She can handle herself, but she shouldn't have to be in that situation, I'm just saying. What a good guy. He can't enter cities. He's a spared. He's not allowed. Wants to protect the innocent. Although Rudy's far from innocent. Fair enough. We got a bad reputation. He wants to rectify that. Where I'm a good guy. We're not as bad as you say we are. We don't eat children. It's not true. Wow, that animation was intense. Story from the dark side of history. We began to change. Right, they were corrupted. It was a subtle change. Wow. The place fucked them up. Shit, they became monsters. Wow. Bad reputation. Let me fix it. This spear is the soul of my son? What the heck? Oh, it was a curse. Okay. So they're cured. Cursed spears. Right. We were bad there for a little while, but we're good now. Cursed spears made them murder everyone. Interesting. I'm liking the story elements of this. 
We all got regret, my man. Help him. The words from the man god. May I call you father in law? Because yeah, I'm going to marry her one day. No. Wow, big ass sword. What about me? I want a sword. Hello? Did well. Good work, Eris. I like her. She's growing on me. Is the J silent like a Ruid? Ruid? I'm sure you guys will correct me in the, in the comments. Thank you so much. Okay. Yeah, very good. I like it when we kind of focus in on this on this on this amazing story. Like the world building is amazing. Like there's a really 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 great anime in here which is tainted occasionally by the the, the dirty shit. And I see that as a, a co like a, a common thread um, amongst the fandom. It's it's really well done. Like there wasn't there was only like a hint of it in, in this episode when um Rudy was sitting over Eris as she fell asleep and he just had that that little evil laugh but yeah interesting we met a new character we're on a different continent we've got to get home and we're relying on each other for help to make that progress it's all about redemption and getting home <laughs> roxy is a milf <laughs> sorry wasn't i didn't say it they they said it in the phone so that was a really good episode i'm loving the show and i'm kind of curious about the manga so those of you who've read the manga and are watching the anime is it pretty much one for one is it really super faithful are they deviating away in any way uh, making changes because i don't really have a lot of uh shelf space i can't fit in any more manga unless i'm really 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 interested in it like i've just bought all the free run because free run was amazing and I'm, I'm digging this show like i said it's it's really great storytelling and world building with just a slight edge to it which isn't necessarily um comfortable but for the most part it's really 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 good I'm, I'm curious as to where this story's going i mean after the last episode and finding out the kids woke up in the demon continent and they're gonna try and get home again this is not somewhere i thought the story was gonna go that was i'm like what um meeting new characters going to roxy's hometown and meeting her family learning that they age really slowly and roxy's 44 years old this guy Ru Rory rigid Ruijid? Oh, come on, you tell me. You know who I mean. 400 years old at least, and he's been part of this tribe of people, like a whole generation of folk who've got a very bad reputation because of Laplace, who I'm assuming is a demon, gave them cursed spears and that made them feral and kill everyone. And now his spear has got the, the soul of his son in it, which broke the curse, and now it's all about redeeming that reputation and getting um, some respect back. So a lot of story in one episode are uh, very cool. Episode 9 has just like really changed course, and I'm here for it. So anyway, guys, please uh, comment down below. Don't forget like and subscribe. Catch you next time. Thanks for watching.